I survived 100 days on a fork in Minecraft Hardcore. <laughs> no, really, a fork. There's treasures hidden everywhere, other platforms to explore, and I get to live on everyone's favorite utensil, all while giving you facts about the fork. You'll love it. My main goal is to conquer this fork and to defeat the Ender Dragon. If you enjoy this amazing movie, I'd really appreciate it if you'd subscribe. Also, 30,000 likes and I'll make another 100 days movie. Oh, and if my Twitter gets to 100,000 followers before 2022 is over, I'll release my hardcore world download. Now, sit back, relax and i hope you enjoy this fork movie oh ow oh, man oh gee the plane it it crashed oh man where are we no way <laughs> we're on a giant fork so i think it's safe to say that we're not at disney world i'm gonna leave all that here i don't i don't want starting uh items oh man what a beautiful day so i do want to go to every single one of these islands but first we have so much to do on here hello sheep First things, ow! First things first, we gotta get us a tree. Alrighty, let's get situated. Okay, so we're gonna be smart. We're gonna get some stuff. We need to sleep really fast. Uh, oh my, no. Oh my God, they're enchanted. They're enchanted. Oh, they are. No, 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 no. Uh, oh, they're over there as well. Oh my God, there's so many enemies. <gasps> Sheep. Give me your wool. No, he fell into the void. No, 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 no. Oh, there's wool here. Please, 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 please. Oh my gosh. Oh, we have to run. We have to run. We have to run. We have to run. No, 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 no. No, no. See you later. See you later. No, that's not the exit. Oh, who knew surviving on a fork would be so hard? Oh my gosh. <laughs> I want to go home. Burn so I can actually start my day. Yes. Come out from behind the block. Oh God. One, it's a baby. Make it even worse. It's a zombie. Oh no. We need to be very careful with all of the animals. Like I can't just go around and start killing them or at least the ones that I, uh, I want to keep for the entire movie. Hey boys, you don't mind me uh, collecting that, do you? No, 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 stop, stop, stop it. No, don't touch that. Oh, this might be really deadly. I need the bones. Oh, there's arrows, there's arrows. Okay, I can make a bed. Uh, yeah, we're gonna survive off of rotten flesh for now. You know, my hunger will drain a lot, but at least I will heal. Okay, animals, please just don't jump off of the fork. Okay, well, we at least have every single biome, so that's good. I think we just get kind of situated in here. This... This might be the smartest plan, you know, we just please do not be thunder again. I mean, even if it is thunder, it doesn't even matter because haha, -ha, I can sleep. It's time to advance in the world. We're going to collect this iron. It'll be a very big surprise, but I think we're very limited on resources in this world. So we have to be very sparing with that iron. Nice and open. And then this is how you make a door and make ourselves all of these tools. This is very important. So this is a good beginning house, but I don't want to to stay in here oh there's iron oh god it's the void but there's irons get the iron and then we get out oh that's so much iron yes we need to find villagers i have to make an iron farm if we get enough eggs we can also make a chicken farm the the leather armor is looking really fine right now wow i look so cool <laughs> let's go see what's on the island over here very nice maybe now we can get to full health and then what's down here oh there's bamboo give me yes we have an infinite source for fuel okay we checked out the entire fork there really isn't much for us here so every single ship that we see is going to hold quite literally everything that we need. Now, if I didn't know any better, I would think that this is the map. And for tonight, we sleep in the plane again, which you can also sleep in my merch. All of my items are incredibly soft and comfortable. I made sure they're not gilded. I have a limited release hoodie that's about to leave the store, so you have a limited amount of time to get it if you want it. We just added some new bucket hats, shirts, and some kid clothing there. Thank you to everyone who's been buying my merch and supporting my channel. I appreciate you all a ton. Oh, hey, did you know that the fork was most likely invented in Eastern Roman Byzantine Empire? Don't worry, I have a lot of those. <laughs> you guys are gonna love this video. And we're gonna have to keep an eye on the saplings. We desperately need those bad boys, but at least I have a lot of dirt so we can make a nice tree farm. I also need to make an actual farm. I very desperately need food. So all the trees in this little area right here have been removed. Biggest reason is that now whenever mobs come over here, they don't have any kind of protection from the sun. They will just die. That's really nice. The one thing I don't know if I want to do or not is for my house. It, do I want to go and build off and then make my own island so I'm safe from all the enemies? Or do I just want to make like a house on here? I kind of want to mine this entire plane just so I can get a lot of quart blocks or quartz. Wait, there's a chest down here. Oh, hey. Broken glass sharpness 
too. Now we have full leather armor. And then I think we could do something with the bees. Not too shabby for today. I at least removed the left wing. Did you know that the pointy part on forks are called tines? So I am starving a bit on food right now and I really should make that farm. But I think let's just go through, clear out more of the plane. At least remove the roof from it so that then if anything wants to spawn inside of there or hide in here, they'll catch on fire. Well, there goes all of my picks. So, uh, ooh, and then since I'm only getting, you know, slabs out of this, I can actually make my house spawn proof. Coal seems to be very hard to get in this world, but I also might not need coal because, oops. And then let's start smelting the iron. Luckily, that will use up one coal. Let's just put the items that I don't need with me in here. Clear everything up. Oh, let's actually start on a bamboo farm. That would be very nice. We can actually make a bow. There. And then we're going to start the bamboo farm like right here. So instead of making charcoal, I can actually just use bamboo. Let's remove a little bit more of the roof. I guess now is a really good time to do it because, you know, I'm kind of running out of food. We're going to go oh, hi. Mwah, mwah. I just kiss his butt. So we need to go get some seeds. Issue. I need a bucket for water. Oh, hey, look, there's iron. So, oh, man, I was so worried I would have to go back to that other river with all the enemies there. Oh, man, that would have been bad. And now we don't need a big farm. You know, we can make something, you know, tiny and cute. So let's just break you. Water goes there. Yes, yes. Give me a lot. Thank you. Okay, we can make it least one two pieces of bread i think for right now this is actually going to be a, a a weird time for me i can't sprint <laughs> it uses up too much hunger up next i want to have some fun and make a composter okay so that's how you make a composter there we go let's actually get rid of you and now every single flower that i've ever gotten can go into here wait this is very important okay i actually have to do this to survive let me pick up the bed you go there you go there and amazing and that's totally not because it matches my blindfold let's actually clear out the land a little bit right here you know it's always nice to have some dirt but also i want to make an infinite water pool right here just so I don't have to keep running back and forth from the jungle. But let's remove all of this. We're going to make it a lot easier because since I am growing a lot of wheat and I help you instead of making a lot of bread, what I could do is just bring over some animals and then, you know, make some pens for them. We're going to try and be quick today. We'll leave this wing for later. So in the immediate area, there are a lot of sheep, which it isn't bad. I just would much rather prefer cows because I believe steak or replenish more. Plus it would give me leather and I can use that for books and also leather armor in case I never find any villagers for a, uh, a very nice and a humane iron farm that they will love and totally go in there not against their will. And then let's actually chop this down a little bit. I think we're going to extend the land out with the dirt. And then we might as well just collect all the dirt over here. Okay, so if I were to make an animal farm, we'll be very kind and generous to the animals. How about that? And then if we go this way. Oh, hey, look, I found where all the sounds are coming from. There's a uh, abandoned mine shaft down there. And then let's go through fill in the ground. Okay, so we need a little bit more dirt, but I don't know where to get it from. <laughs> so I'm going to travel around. We're going to see if we can find some dirt in spots like this. Maybe some dirt over here. Yeah, okay, sweet. Actually, here, we could use this for some sticks. I still wish that you could put bamboo in composters. I really don't understand why you can't. Oh, <gasps> yo, what up, homie? Oh my, dude, how did you know that I needed leads? You're so kind. Oh my, and I... You brought me leather? Okay, hopefully this is enough. Ooh, farm is complete. Very nice. I mean, we can always extend it, make it bigger, but I think we'll be good. Okay, we'll make 27, two fence gates, and then I think we can make a pretty nice farm. Oh, wait, actually, here, this is probably really smart or incredibly stupid. I mean, I should have been smart and uh, turned it all into, into slabs, but hey. Okay, that's actually incredibly annoying to me um it's off centered here do i chop this up and add another layer of dirt that so now we have one two three four five six 
One, two, three, four, five, six. Wow, we really, really need trees to start growing around here. Like, it's actually starting to get bad. I don't know why that's not growing. Oh, no, I have one more. I chew. And then let's make three torches because I really want to start lighting up some areas around here. I think now is the best time to go for animals. I am hurting so much for food. Oh, no, don't tell me it's only one cow. Yo, Betsy, what's up? Don't you dare walk off that edge. You follow me. Come on, Betsy. Betsy, come on. I might have to run ahead and sleep and then come back and get you. Betsy, I'm coming. And welcome to your new and lovely home, especially one that uh, you can't run off the edge of the map and die. So this might be the first time ever in my entire Minecraft life, but I think I'm actually going to grow these for food. Please tell me there's a cow over here. Uh-oh. Let's go check back over there. You know, maybe there's another cow. I swear I heard, you know, another one back there at a different location. While we're here, let's actually collect more coal i'm taking this bell and then it's a wild hunch but i'm just i'm guessing on this one i think there's villagers inside of this plane up there i kind of want to see what's in this mine shaft hi i'll at least take the rails do i really want to take everything in it seems very cheesy it seems uh, very strong wow you know what i think we deserve it you know Ooh, what's in the igloo wow wow and there's even more okay the rails from these because i might have to make a rail system in the future for the villagers like especially if they're up there make this a little bit more roomy let's actually just chop down the tree oh man what to do i mean we're gonna keep the cow alive i'm not i'm not gonna kill the cow we'll probably treat it as you know royalty and we'll make a nice room for it in our house there's so much loot in these i'm really sorry if that makes any of you angry that i take that stuff of that good free loot at least we have a name to so I can name one. Oh, I can name Betsy. Yeah, once I make an anvil, then we're, uh, we're totally set on that. I think we should go and get those uh, those pigs. Oh, Mr. Oink Oinks, I'm coming. And pigs, let's go. There we go. We can call that one Techno and we call that one Blade. Okay, let's make this bigger. Okay, let's not make this bigger. Okay, can you guys get up now? Man, I never knew that was gonna be so difficult to get some pigs over here. And here you go. Welcome to your new and very lovely home. Oh, wait, I don't have any carrots. Okay, so, so far I have three animals that I can't kill. I might use that name tag on one of the pigs and just name them Techno. So then I at least know which one's Techno and which one's Blade. <gasps> Ooh, and I also want the lantern. And then we're just gonna break the chest. We'll take everything. Ooh, even more stuff in the barrel i want to get to an island oh man do i have to build a bridge to every single one of them i mean that one's close and it looks really friendly in there like it doesn't look like there's anything evil or bad in there that would want to kill me okay so we're gonna do it a very mature adult way scientific eeny meeny miny mo catch a tiger by its toe and you are it okay so we're gonna go to the another one first so i think we climb the tallest tree and then we just chop it all the- Oh my god, that was so loud. With all of the jungle logs, let's make it all into planks. It's gonna be super ugly. Yay, we get a bridge all the way. I'm actually surprised how little of wood that actually took to get here. So we have an incomplete portal. Let me guess, there's obsidian in here. So as I was saying, let me guess, there's obsidian in here. Anything hidden? But it did give us some nice stuff. I might actually not need to get any obsidian. So I need one, I need one obsidian. I need a diamond pick and I need one obsidian. Look at how beautiful she is. But I think tomorrow we're gonna go to that island. This should be enough planks to get up there because that really didn't take that much. Actually here, while we're here, you look mighty fine. I feel like I'll need you. By the way, if you guys could leave a comment for my editor, because yeah, she has a lot of these to do, you know, the speed montages that we all love so much and with how much work that they are and how frequent they are and also just how good of a job that she does on editing. Yeah, if you guys could leave a comment, like, thank you, Meg, we appreciate you. That'd be really awesome. Wow, this Poland can into space. A little lackluster up here. I I'm sure there's really good loot hidden somewhere. <gasps> oh, 
I didn't. Oh, no way. Oh, no way. Oh, it's day 14 and we can fly. And look, I got the achievement named after me. Oh, I'm so happy we came here. Ooh, feather falling. Oh, and there's a notch apple. Okay, no, we, we actually we will need to come back here. We need to go back to the base. We need to drop off our entire inventory. I'm a little scared to use that elytra without putting unbreaking on it. Okay, next, let's actually tend to the farm. Okay, with that all done, let's go make the super fun track and get all the way back up there. <laughs> I wonder if I should go mining. First off, I really want these. These look really cool. I'm going to take that. I am very curious what that is. Other than death, because I see lava, magma blocks. I think I see gold right there. Then we have Bumble over there or a statue to her. And then I guarantee you that's an entire battle arena. If I just start digging here, am I going to find anything? Well, it doesn't give off much light, but at least it's something. <gasps> Oh, oh, a lot of obsidian. Oh, where are the enemies? Like they sound like they're right here. Oh my God. Oh God, no. Oh my, hi. The zombie I'm not worried about, but the amount of creepers that are in there, wow. Okay, buddy. Nope, 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 nope. You gotta die fast. What is in this chest? Whoo. Oh, hey, there's some lapis. Well, hello, gorgeous. Oh my. I really want to keep exploring this place. That's a block of coal. Oh, so now I definitely need to get better armor. Don't worry, I promise to return once I uh, have a lot stronger. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God, they're everywhere. Oh my God. Oh man. Yeah, let's return back home. Okay, let's spend a little bit of time getting organized. So now that we have an elytra in the equation and we have a lot more of these berries, I need to harvest you all. So I believe I saw some sugar cane over here. Okay, luckily I was right. So all of these lovely beauties. I feel like I need to terraform the entire fork. Parkour! And then I feel like this should lead somewhere. But at the same time, I don't have any torches and I don't know if I really want to find something. Oh my, hi. And the sooner I make a diamond pick, ooh, I can also go to the nether when I make one. This is definitely not going to be... <laughs> The sugarcane farm, but it's at least a start. Why are you not growing? There we go. You're just a, you're just a little shy. Because I want to start collecting a lot of logs. I might be smarter to go for the jungle ones, but I'm going to start getting a lot more logs because I really need to make some charcoal. Uh, let's do some more logs over here. Ooh, okay. Let's actually get the jungle logs to 64, and then we can actually just smelt all of those, and then we'll have 64 charcoal and then we can finally make some torches. We will actually have stuff to, you know, to cook iron whenever we get those. Like, oh, it'll be incredible. That should be enough coal for the logs to completely cook everything. And we won't have any more uh, coal in there. Okay, so we have one diamond. We're going to make that into a pick. Okay, there's the other diamond. So we can almost make a diamond pick. Oh, we're almost making progress. I'm also just really tired of seeing this wing. So I really want to remove it. I'm trying to remember how to make a campfire. Plop this down right here. We'll put you right there. So let's actually go back to that cave and we're going to mine out the diamonds. Hi, 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 hi. Wow. Yours is actually better than mine. Thanks. <laughs> I need to make torches really badly. Hi, zombie. Why are you there? Let's go and chop down our bamboo. We need more sticks. Okay, yep. You know what? We're in the Iron Age now, so we're just gonna make our... We're, we're gonna spoil ourselves. So here's an iron sword. In fact, let's make a stone sword because I don't want to waste iron on, uh, on bamboo. Okay, that is a ton of sticks. Most likely we'll never need to make any more for the rest of the movie. Our mission is quite literally just that one diamond block. That, that is all that I I want diamond oh yes two oh three four some of this out no bee okay well we might have an insanely limited amount of honey from the bees full oh my god i saw it out of the corner of my eye okay so now that we have the diamond pick let's go back up to the island which will take me about 17 minutes to climb that staircase and then we can finally get the obsidian that we need and then build the nether portal i think oh no i can actually make a flint and steel right now so we can actually go to the nether oh, oh we finally made it and done okay goodbye you guys better leave a like i hope you guys enjoy this so much because i'm being terrorized by creepers non-stop because if we can get enough villagers i can actually use them to get me every single type of enchantment that i want we at least have stuff so we can eat and survive so that, that is a humongous plus okay let's go have some fun in the super duper hot place i need a flint and steel never mind 
Okay, that luckily didn't take too long. Okay. Oh yeah, did you know that forks are actually banned in the White House because over 27 people have been murdered by them in there? Just don't look that up, okay? I promise you, it's totally real. So I could be, you know, efficient, take them out of the corners, but eh, you know, we ball. Wait, is that just a ghost town? There you go on your own risk. You go there on your own risk. That's not making the final cut. Oh, gotcha. Okay, so it's parkour all the way into a castle that looks like a battle arena. Instead of going all the way down there and through all of that, um, what if I'm just smart? I collect some nether rack. Gotcha. Spawners everywhere. And you're just looking at me all weird. Um, never mind. We'll we'll do the parkour route because I already know that a lot of you are gonna be mad if I don't do it. You probably don't even need to jump with some of these. You could probably just walk. Boing, 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 boing. Kind of just want to jump straight onto the ground right now. I am not doing that back up. That's going to be a lot harder going up. I think I'm safe to just parkour over. Boing, boing, boing. Uh, ooh. Oh, a bookshelf. Oh, hey. I mean, I don't know what I would need them for, but sure. Let's just take the books just to be safe. Hello? Is it safe? Oh, that's right. <laughs> you can't walk through the doorway <laughs> i'm gonna leave that spawner just because it spawns in uh weather skeletons and those are actually useful wow oh this is a very very big dungeon hello hi buddies yeah let, we're we're gonna eat that okay uh let's try that again you woo, miss me now you gotta kiss me okay i can i, I can sound like some people <clears throat> What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my hardcore episode where today I'm making a wither skeleton farm. Can you not be smart and wait around the corner, you little butthead? I actually... you. Um, I do actually want to break the... I'm on half a heart. <laughs> this is so bad. I need real food. <gasps> Ooh. So I basically need to beat this entire castle without getting hit. Uh, we're just gonna eat a golden apple. Help! Oh my god. 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 Oh god. <laughs> oh man. Yo, if this is your castle, maybe you should have, you know, built pathways where you could actually fit into. I should have made a diamond sword before coming here. Oh my. Efficiency two, and it's called the Diax. Run, run, run. Next thing. I need to find where those parkour blocks were. We're going to use every single type of block that I have to try and get out of here. Ow. Oh, I have two apples. Parkour skills, please do not fail me now. Yes. Yes. Oh, oh, I'm going home. I'm going home. I'm going home. Get me out of here. Oh, wow. Okay. Before we ever go back in there, we are getting food. Bread for right now. We'll cut it. Give me one second. Hi, buddy. Come here. Oh, yeah. Okay. So we have two chickens. There you go. So we got Donald Duck, Daffy Duck. I think those 16 eggs spawned in three chickens, four chickens. Oh, let's actually focus on the wood. I just don't know what type of house I want to build. I really want to break away from my typical uh, medieval, like fantasy look. I'm, I'm feeling something futuristic. Oh, chore day is a fun day. First, I'm so sorry, Iron Sword. That took out so, so much durability. It doesn't even matter if I use charcoal or coal or, you know, like if I waste anything, because boom, I have a lot of bamboo. And then I can cook all of these so that then I can get back into the nether even faster. Okay, so this fish should be done. Okay, so that's all done. Oh, wait, I need to cook the potatoes. Oh, I need to save one potato. Wait, 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 wait. I'm saving one potato in case I want to make a potato farm, which I really doubt that I want to, but I like to have the option there. Yeah, you, you guys really suck. Oh, creepers don't destroy anything on this map? Ooh, okay, wait, we have five wheat, 16 bones. Okay, we're gonna get a whole lot of bread from this. 29 wheat, do I make a diamond sword? Yeah, put a stick there. Okay, so we're gonna keep using the iron sword until it breaks. Okay, let's actually get more nether rack. I don't think skeletons will spawn there anymore. Anyone that's gonna be mad that I'm not going the parkour route, uh, don't care. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, this is the tower that I actually completed. I just saw for a little second, yeah, there is a skeleton up there with an enchanted bow. Oh, I need you very badly. There's so many! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh, oh my, oh my, oh my god, oh my god. How are you supposed to fight that? Please, please, please. Oh, okay, I don't play fair. Oh, <laughs> give me that bow. Oh, I need that bow. Oh, and look at that. I have an anvil right here. 
boom boom this is the navy seal sniper i'm definitely gonna go check that out let's actually do every single tower i don't hear any skeletons i hear skeletons now wow this is by far one of the worst chests i have ever seen actually i'm still gonna take it but i'm not taking any of the dies no 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 you didn't see me rush 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 break 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 yes i mean maybe these are good to take because i can give it to a villager here we, we got the inventory space we'll, we'll take this now comes uh the middle section seems almost done i don't think i should break that blaze spawner though oh Oh, Ooh, I did not get every single chest. You know what? Just so we're safe, maybe we do break the blaze spawner. I mean, it's the nether. Oh, ooh, yeah, I'm keeping you right there. Oh, I wonder if there's a notch apple in every single lake of the castle. Yes. Isn't that our second one? Okay, rush, rush, rush. Oh, I need you. It's just a feeling that I have. Like there, there's nothing backing it up whatsoever, but um, I don't think there's anything down there. Whoa. Let me safely bridge it all our way down. Oh, man. I just made this diamond sword, <laughs> but I want to get to that chest too. And then we just <laughs> go right inside just like that. <gasps> Ooh, another right. I think the only thing is just, I can get inside. Oh my gosh. Oh, Ooh, my heart was racing. I just, I don't think I should break their spawner. Also, since they can't go through like a two block thing, let's just break this. I'm trying to think if I need the nether wards for anything and I really don't think I need them. I wonder if there's anything below this. Uh, death. I think I'm going to farm until I get 20 bones and then I'll be good to go. Can you give me some bones? Okay, 18 bones. I'm, I'm kind of okay to leave now. So I don't really want to, but I guess one of the best ways back home is, you know. Oh no, I can't do parkour if there's a ghast right there. Okay, the game heard me and there we go. You to you. I'm only talking right now so that I can put this into the video so you guys don't think that I cheated to get back up. And there we go. Okay, so let's go. Oh my God, I I really just don't want to go back to the fork. Oh, that's why I hear so many zombies at my base. It's because of the abandoned mine shaft. Okay, creepers. No, I wanted that gunpowder. Don't blow up, don't blow up, thank you. There's so many creepers. Torches all around here. Oh, I have three name tags. Wait, and I have anvils. So first one, Betsy. The next one is Techno. And then the last one is Blade. We will never get confused on any of them. So that's Betsy. You could be Techno. You are Blade. If you guys can actually grow up faster, that would be really appreciated. Wow, I look incredible. I really want to check out the bee. I'm so curious what's in it. Even though I'm, I'm pretty positive it's going to be bees. I'm just hoping that the bees don't go boo. Okay, so do I just mine my way in like wherever i want is it just a solid bee okay so it's full of terracottas and it's quite dead inside oh wow oh this is actually incredible 100 we are going to be making a beehive i have no way of collecting this thing uh, i think i can actually make it with a three honeycomb we'll save that for a later date we can actually go and check out the ghost town you guys have sand and you know, ice in your water tower that's not good my might not be safe to stay here. Okay, it is really not safe to stay here. Okay, so the turd colored bed uh, was really nice. Hi, bud. Sweet, we can actually name Bumble. Probably shouldn't have come here with a full inventory. Yeah, we actually should just return home. Don't think we need to use a rocket at all. Aha, okay, beehive, good. So we've got a beehive for the bees. Ooh, let's just name it now. So this one will be Bumble. We actually need to go back to that town. I can actually use those hay bales for food. Yeah, you. Okay, I don't think there's anything else on the wagon. Oh, Ooh, okay. I thought there was actually, you know, a trap down here or something dangerous. After many hours, he finally gave up. Here are the coordinates. Ooh, iron axe, thank you. <laughs> Ooh, I see you, queen. Uh. What We'll take this back home and send damage poison poison oh hello i think we'll come back tomorrow because there, there's still a lot more very sadly only two of you can breed thank you for the eggs i would use the sharpshooter but i just i like bows more okay let's go back to the farm boom 10 more oh my i almost just jumped off the island without having my elytra on would not have been good oh 
Ooh. Ooh, I actually wouldn't mind you. Negative 185, 50, 18. Yeah, we're gonna go to that tomorrow. Oh, here we go here. So whenever we get more armor, we'll actually take it and then we'll just put it in here and then boom, he could be with all the chickens. Okay, so we need to go to negative 185, 50, 18. Oh, I think it's over there. And then it should be right here, a legitly high. Oh my. There's overkill. And then there's like immense overkill. And then there's this. <laughs> the only bad thing is I don't believe either of these have the enchantment on it for it to come back to me. Make a new chest there. Next on our list that I remembered right now. Okay, so let's, I'll make a very pretty staircase where we're gonna try very hard on it. Make sure it looks so high. No baddies down here, right? Nobody who wants to hurt me is uh, in this cave. Wow, I'm actually shocked. This is like a legit uh, abandoned mine shaft. Not too bad. Please give me a lot of diamonds. I'm just trying to think of when do I want to go and search for the villagers. Hi, boys. Ah, okay. So I'm going to take a wild guess. And I think this is a creeper spawner. And break that. I know, I know. I could have made it into an XP grinder, blah, blah, blah. The map creator really likes giving out uh, god apples. Also taking all of these because I might need this. And perfect. I think now, once I get the last of this, we have collected everything in this cave, almost. How do I still hear these zombies? Oh, you who are there? any i i'm gonna need you to quiet down okay like it's really loud i can hear you above the ground yeah the bat too the bat was really noisy as well what is this there's i i don't know if i can take this i don't know um i'll i'll think about it i think it's time to actually build my house and i think i have a really funny idea for this that i totally didn't get from any of my friends on discord that this is 100 percent original uh my idea no one else i want to make my house a spoon <laughs> Okay, so we'll use these for down here. As much as I would love to fall off, I would, you know, prefer not to. Bees, like, I promise you, if you just come back, you can go back into your beehive. I'll leave the armor here, maybe. Let's actually remove a little bit of the tail, and then let's flatten this part out. Okay, so we need this all to be the same size. As long as you don't look at the underside of this, it looks perfect. Okay, and then we completely remove this. Very perfect. And then we're gonna make the spoon, like, pretty large. I will be needing a lot of space. Okay, we're gonna move you. This will actually be the guard for the spoon, so he'll be watching this direction for us. Perfect. Perfect. I feel safer already. Shoo. This is my spoon. I mean, not bad. We got 26 iron. Okay, so I have six of those. Wow, I might actually be able to get a lot of netherite. Thank you. And stone cutter. So one issue that I'm having with the spoon design is that if we keep it with this width, it's going to look very weird if we go like super far out and have like a certain, you know, like like the spoon part of it, you know? Well, we do have a lot of slabs. I guess we can do this and, you know, widen it up a little bit. And done. It's a lot wider. This might actually work pretty well. I have a strong feeling we will be needing to go back into the nether to collect more of this, which I'm honestly kind of okay with. Oh, wait, we could actually build the entire spoon out of slabs i'm trying to think of anything that i can add to the side of the spoon to make it just so like i can't run off the edge and then on top of that we have anvils you see where i'm going absolutely perfect okay now our elytra should be able to last us the entire movie So it's super long. Oh man, that, that's gonna take so many blocks, but I think this would actually be a good size. And then that's when we start making the, you know, the spoon head. Oh, hey, did you know that all forks are made out of stainless steel? And that's why you almost never see any stains on them. I'll give you a different scenery shot. Well, I guess we're going to the nether a whole lot sooner than uh, what we were thinking. Fingers crossed for it, you know, just everything to go super smoothly. We find the quartz, we get enough, then we get out. I think quartz would be this direction. Kind of sick and tired of accidentally flying, so there we go. Oh, okay, wait, 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 there's a lot in here. Yes, I wish I had fortune. I think, no, I don't think I had anything with fortune on it back in the base. At least there's a ton of gold. This wasn't really that good of another spawn. Okay, I'm starting to think that I just need to fly out of this biome no no 
Before you despawn, thank you. So since Quartz is really hard to find, and I have a very strong feeling that you guys don't want to watch me in the nether for like 60 days just mining this, maybe we make the spoon part of the spoon out of like birch logs. We're definitely only going to be collecting enough just to finish off the handle. Well, I mean, now I'm starting to find a whole ton of Quartz. Oh, glowstone. I'm finally out of soul sand. Yes, what a beautiful biome. Oh, I love you. Give me if you were literally not in like the worst spot ever, I would actually collect you. I really, really want to use glowstone on the spoon. Here we go. Let's go say hi to the locals. I hear you, piggy. You don't have any proof. That wasn't me. What's up, boys? I'm just trying to collect enough to where I don't need hey, buddy. Hi. Damn. You guys can have it. Oh, no way. So if we can actually find those pigs, I definitely want to farm them. Like the chicken farm is coming along very well, but uh, it could be doing better. Why can't glowstone ever just spawn on the ground? Oh. Ooh, hell, hello. I think once we get a stack, we should be pretty good. I do want to collect glowstone before I go back home. And then I want to get some pork chops. I hope all of you who are watching this movie are wearing sunglasses. You will be needing it. You might need some SPF 30 on as well. Tee hee hoo hoo. Ow, hi piggies. Ooh, thank you, Bo. All right, watch this. I'll go for your kid. Ooh. Miss me, miss me. Now you gotta kiss me. Pigs. There's another hoggy woggy. Nah, it's okay. No, you really don't need to come over here. Tee hee hoo hoo. I'm coming for you. Hee hee. Either hoggy woggies. Yes, I need. But yeah, I saw a comment from one of you and uh, they were telling me how that block, the nether wart block, is actually apparently the uh, the best thing. Like this is the best thing that you could put into your composter for like the highest return for bone meal. So thank you for that. Okay, my little hoggy woggy, come here. See, this is my type of fight. You know, this is very fair. It's very fun. Thank you so much for the food. Yep, stay right here. Very good. For all the uh, the Minecraft pros out there, do hoglins respawn? I really don't think that they do. Look at the cluster on this thing. Oh, it barely missed it. Let's go. Uh, I think we're going to click this one too. Okay, I need to stop using the pick. We have a stack and a half. Just because we're over here, and the force is right there. Let's go check it out. I want to see if we can find any more hoglins. Hello, Enderman. And not hit me like that, like a freight train. One pearl, but uh, I'll take it. Oh my. Stop running. No. Okay, come here, mama. Oh, the piglin killed it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come over here. Come over to the meat grinder. I think we are all good. The hard part is going to be finding the portal because I did not write down the coordinates over here. Okay, yep. Good, good. I am uh, kind of lost. Oh, wait. No, no, no. I'm completely lost. Nope. Nope. Not you. Not you. Nope. Nope. No, I am all good. No, no, you don't need to. Oh, hey, look, it's the portal. And would you believe it? I found this quite literally all by accident. Right, let's actually use this. Never mind. Uh, the diamond sword. This shouldn't hurt it like at all. Okay, hopefully bamboo works on it. Nice. Wow. I really love smokers. Wow. Oh, you weren't kidding. To the people that told me to use this block, wow. That's actually incredible. Hey, you, you, you. Oh, wow. There's a lot of you. Okay. Oh, for the first time, we are good on food. Let's make some slabs. I'm going to keep 32 just in case, you know, like if anything uh, jumps out, it's like, oh, wow, I really wish I had more uh, quartz because as much as I would love to go back into the nether to find these again, you know, and uh, collect more, I'm totally good. I wish I could have made the entire thing out of quartz. I swear you keep going farther and farther every single day. So I'll probably make a tree farm uh, on the house. Also, just to be safe. Yeah, we're moving this bed over here. Oh. I just realized I used different ports. So before we actually build the bowl to the spoon, we should probably go and get some birch saplings and actually plant those. Oh, hi. Wow. Okay. Apparently it's going to be incredibly dangerous, very deadly just to go get some wood. That's always lovely. Love to see that. I just want some wood, please. Oh, come on. We need to actually start making farms. Maybe building a dedicated area to our trees wouldn't be a bad idea. We should make a mob farm. Hopefully get a lot of skeletons out of it, get a lot of arrows from it. That might actually be really good. Was that all the birch?
Oh, hi, hi, hi. Yeah, this this is why I'm trying to get rid of every single tree. Uh, I, oh, no, I have no more arrows. Yay, you finally grew. Woo. Not too bad of a day. Okay, thinking about it. I actually think if I go over here and I build a mob farm like right here, this should be good enough. I mean, we're going to build it a little bit away. Maybe that'll make it better. But I think if I have like, you know, my safe area, my home over there, and then we have a deadly area with a lot of enemies that I don't want to touch over here, that should be good. Okay, we're going to be fancy and we're going to use, I think this would be like a really nice contrast with it. First off, let's clean up this. Actually, I think it'd be kind of cool if we start off very wide and then it got very narrow and then we cover up the airplane down there because that's how you should deal with your problems i'm kidding and then we're not poor so we're gonna make it three wide oh man once again oh man i should have put this one slab down but now i have to put torches up here man i could have made it spawn proof so i think this should be good enough the center platform is going to be about a three by three. We want to go about three out on each side. I'm out of wood. Okay, I didn't think it was going to be uh, using this much. This should be enough slabs to actually finish it. There we go. Basically, we just need to fill it in. And there we go. Platform done. And this is the perfect mob spawner. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm not going to look up on YouTube on how to make one of these. I'm going to kind of guess because I think I know how to make it. So I'm sure nothing's going to go wrong. Also, I can already tell this is going to bug so many people. So there you go. I, I hope you're happy. So I believe this is everything that we're going to need to actually build the entire thing oh we need trap doors so i think i don't know why i kind of want to make it out of jungle logs i'll end up having like dark oak slabs on top maybe this would look cool you guys should have told me that i built it one two short come on we're supposed to be working together on this come on and then one thing that i've learned is that if you put a trap door underneath here creepers won't blow up like i i really do not have that much uh iron at all at some point we are going to have to go mining again how high do i build this i think it was 18 I mean, even if it's not 18, it doesn't exactly matter because I'm not using this for XP. I'm just using this just to get items. So, oh, hey, look, they'll have about four hearts when they fall down. <laughs> oh, we're out. Oh, uh, you know, this is this is close enough. It's a really giant L. Yeah, that's a message to all the haters out there that weirdly don't exist. You guys are really kind, actually. <laughs> I actually really like my fans. You guys are very supportive. Okay, so what I think that we do is we just completely build the entire thing. Don't put the roof on. And then we use the wood to actually make the trap doors. And then that should be good. Of course, I could be smart and, you know, use slabs instead of, you know, planks but I, I think we're fine i mean at least you can barely tell but um yeah i'm now out of spruce now we're on the jungle <laughs> <laughs> and then from this, I believe we make it too tall and then we carry it all the way around. Again, going off of memory, it's been a little bit since I've had to build one of these. But I mean, this looks correct. Because then I think we put the trap doors there. Those go down. Oh no, am I going to have to go chop down more trees to finish this? I thought I had enough wood. I thought I actually had more than enough. I really want to use up all of these logs before it's nighttime. I don't want things spawning up here with me. Yeah, I think we just need to bring up the walls like two levels all the way across. And then I think we're basically good. So I would go back up there and finish building. But that's the last amount of logs that I have. Or planks that I have for it. So yeah, and we can't use any of this for it. I mean, oh yeah, no, no, we still have some more trees to actually chop down. And then before we even have to plant our own trees, we do have the jungle over here. Okay, after an entire day of chopping down trees, I think we have enough wood to actually finish this build. So I believe we have everything. Of course, I could make a second bucket so I can make infinite water sources up there, but eh, I'd rather just go up there, fly down, get you know more water, go back. So at least from the front when I'm down there, this will all look like it's a uh, oak logs up here or blanks up here, but we know that's gonna be a lie. <laughs> yeah, and then I think we just go around like this. Perfect, okay. So I was actually correct on it being 64 trap doors. You need to lower every single trap door. And then we put another, water source right there this one should be unlimited so now we just have to keep on running back and forth yeah i believe i believe this is all good and done i really don't want to have to tear anything down or come back and fix it and done okay the roof is completely finished they might not be spawning in here just because it is nighttime no 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 uh-uh uh-uh go away child how oh, scary oh god for anything i want to see if the chickens oh it's working here we'll put this in the front kind of near the center and then we'll just put the jungle ones around it in the back here we go creepers please don't see me we could even just put them down just like this one that 
actually looks pretty cool. Wow, this works incredibly fast. I love worlds where there's like a void around the entire map so that these just work incredibly well. Don't blow up. Do not blow up. Do not blow up. I saw that dude lighting up and I, I got very worried. Yeah, because I can't get some of these items over there. I mean, I could put down water. Let's see how many hoppers we can even make. Oh, uh, we can make four of a hopper going into that. And then it's kind of nice how the spiders can't climb up the wall. Oh my gosh, we can get iron from this. I'll be there in a second, chickens. Don't you worry. I know exactly what you want. Here you go. Very nice. Yep. Give me a lot more food. Okay. Very good day. I'm actually really, really happy we built that. Oh, that's right. I actually forgot about that. We need to clear up this. So yeah, we're just going to turn this all into bone meal. And then we get some more bone meal. So I wanted to leave that beauty right there for later on. So let's go check out the villagers. I'm hoping there's villagers in there. I might not even need to move them. Maybe I can make an iron farm over there. Oh, I hear him. Hi, John. Wow. Oh, okay, Jack. I really like you. Oh my God. <gasps> oh, we need that. Oh, I miss. Oh, I miss seeing that bad boy so much. Okay. And we can get mending. You can buy an elytra. The God apple is actually pretty dope. I'm not against that at all. Interesting. Okay. I was expecting this to go very, very differently. So we don't very luckily we don't need to build an iron farm. 32 bread is very, very expensive. We can't make books because we only have one cow and I'm not killing Betsy. The apples could do, same with charcoal. So I think what we do is, one, we have to make this a lot bigger. We can use the skeletons from there to get us a lot of bones to grow this even faster. I'm trying to find a nice area to where I can just take a lot of the dirt from it and I won't really care. Yeah, so we could just, you know, take the dirt from here. It really doesn't matter at all. I'm very happy I found those villages before actually deciding to do something crazy. Going from that one block lucky block video to this one, which one, if you haven't seen that video, totally recommend it. Uh, I think it's a very, very nice one to watch. Very calm story. Totally nothing scary happens in that and absolutely like nothing bad happens to me in there. It's very weird to actually have access to a lot of dirt. <laughs> I want to find this cave. I, I keep hearing skeletons and zombies. Here we go. Just to make it even worse, let's just collect the dirt underneath the snow. Okay, so the ground, it looks very beautiful, very happy. And I I think we put the farm oh especially then it'll cover up the ugly side so yeah no no we'll definitely make a farm here and then it's just back to more lovely placing i have about two stacks left but i really wasn't expecting it to be like this small <laughs> it's not the size of the farm that matters it's how you use it this should be good enough okay so we have 37 bones before we go and uh, make the farm I don't think that's gonna be enough to like completely fill up the entire farm. Oh, I'm so excited to get emeralds and actually get some iron. I think we got a lot. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, we almost have a stack of bones. I think we're ready. It's just, oh God, we're gonna have to run back and forth a ton to put down water. Perfect. And then I know that once I till the ground, mobs won't be able to spawn here, but I kind of want to put some glowstone, at least glowstone above this. Cause like, I don't, I don't want it to be like insanely dark. And then we don't need this farm and anymore okay we can at least get started tonight so uh, i think we'll have it just start here i lost one host that's pretty sad but i should be good i'll probably go to the gym or something don't tell me that's too far that's only six blocks at least now i know for the future is that water sources can only go five blocks out i thought it was six and now we actually should be good okay now with that fun hiccup out of the way let's continue this i think it just hit me how many pieces of bread we're going to have to make just for one emerald and then that only gets us one iron i've lost my hose oh it should be completely spawn proof oh hey look it's lightning yep we're sleeping ah what a beautiful sight just almost everything on fire and ah man i just feel so safe except for the ones who cheat and have a helmet on until you hit them off into the void and then it just doesn't matter anymore ah, it's just it's so beautiful so peaceful i actually want to put glowstone up here and this still lights up the entire place it's just it, overall it's just it's very nice so now the place is very nice and lit up so we can actually see it at all times. And then whenever it's nighttime, the weed can actually grow. Speaking of growing, so uh, I mean, maybe I didn't need to spend all these days building a farm. Okay, so that's all of the bone meal that I had and I got almost a stack and a half. But I honestly thought that I was going to get a lot more than that. So maybe building this huge farm actually isn't a waste. And this is a really bad sign. All of that work and I have 37 bread. So I have one emerald right now. Okay, so we'll let those naturally grow. We are going to go farm over there. However, when we were looking at the trades, we can also trade apples. I'm pretty sure these type of trees actually give you a higher rate to get apples, if I'm remembering correctly. Can I help you? Okay, so no, I... 
I, I was most definitely not correct. Um, <laughs> birch saplings do not give you any apples. Okay. I think the other kind of easy one to get was charcoal, which I really don't want to do because it, that, that's way too expensive. If it, if it was like four charcoal for one emerald, then sure, but 16. And then to make it cheaper, because I want to put fences around this so that the wheat and the seeds hopefully don't fly off the edge. I'm pretty sure that fences will actually stop them. So if we use slabs going around, and I guess basically it's just a waiting game. The only issue with this is that it kind of only works as long as it's daytime. And you see when the little boogers spawn in as well, doesn't even matter because there is no way anything can fit through here. Watch Mojang release a mob that can actually go through like this amount of space, like four pixels. Oh, okay, few three trees. Okay, hopefully this is enough. We just gotta be very optimistic about this. 24, I, yeah, that'll, that'll, that'll be enough. There, <laughs> no way that's not gonna be enough, right? I very weirdly don't hate this color combo. I think we need like 24 more if I had to guess and assume. So then is it oak trees that give us apples or like the highest chance at apples? <laughs> okay, so three trees is enough. So that's very nice. First off, get rid of the very lovely eggs. I, I really do appreciate you chickens. Thank you for always bringing it into my inventory. Now we have a stack of these. Let's go back and we're just gonna farm up some more. Actually, you go there, go there. Okay, okay. well, we have 46 of those. Let's get every single apple we have. I do have charcoal. Okay, so let's quickly go check out that shop one more time. Okay, well, we got one there. These trades are actually really bad. Okay, wait, so instead of doing the mob farm where I can, you know, get bones from there, maybe I could go into the nether and find some bone blocks. I at least, I just want mending for at least my elytra. Because if we can actually go and fight the dragon, I, I think I'm just gonna use the elytra. I don't think I'm gonna put on a chest plate because then I can at least fly around everywhere. I could make a diamond helmet and diamond boots. Yeah, so I can make a diamond helmet and diamond boots. So there, so we actually have some kind of protection now. We need to keep on farming and getting stronger so that we can handle the dragon. I'm gonna take a wild guess and say that the end portal's in there. So I don't see any kind of entrance. Oh, okay, phew. <laughs> okay, so, hey, look, I was right. <laughs> oh, not the worst. We need, so no, so we need 10 more. We can actually go to the nether and kill the dragon, which I, I really want to do before this movie ends. Actually, how many eyes of enders do I have? I don't have any blaze rods. I don't think I ever collected any from the blazes. Maybe I shouldn't have broken that spawner. Oh, we have five emeralds now. Oh, I have 15 leather, 15 books. Okay, we can actually get some pretty emeralds with that. Well, let's go back to the villagers. Let's just see if we can get anything. Hi, John, what, how are you doing? I'm I mean, I'm not making an Enderman farm. That would take way too long, but we can farm the Enderman there. Maybe we save up 10 for the mending so that then I can repair my Elytra. What a lovely view. I actually really, really want to do it. I actually want to farm up a lot of Eyes of Ender. Oh, you hoo uh, I like, I don't want to, but we'll just use rockets to get around. You baited me so well. Oh, I'm so proud of you, Enderman, but I hate you so much for that. Go up. Oh my God. Oh God, that was really close to being really bad. Okay, five and 16. At least we're getting food out of this, but I really want a lot more leather. Dang, bro. Woohoo! Wow, that was half a heart. Um, I know I have the totem of undying, but I kind of, you know, don't want to waste it on a hoglin. At least we are getting more pork chops. See, I don't need to like worry about all the pork chops that I'm eating right now because hey, look, I got <laughs> 34 more. I really regret destroying that blaze spawner in that nether fortress castle place well we lost the enderman we gained another crimson forest any hoglins want to donate like i don't know like a thousand leather or something you know something small and nothing too crazy am i okay there we go i was like am i in a ghost town but no Ooh, it's a dangerous job but somebody's got to do it really you're both just gonna team up like that on me like come on i mean we're at 15 leather which isn't bad that's another 15 bucks i think we have four more at home so that's 19. we can get four emeralds so far oh, hello there beautiful you come here often okay there we go okay so shoot them three times and then we do a crit and we almost have an entire stack of raw pork chops every single time that i'm about to say i think we found them all there's just one more that just comes out it's like hey i'm right here and just think if i actually found one more cow wouldn't have to do this it's probably good that i don't use Use any more arrows on them like i'm at 23 and i kind of want to save those for gas yes okay another one down i'm at 30 and i almost have two stacks of raw pork chops come on just one more piglin i really want one more before i go home oh that's an adult oh we need to get over there before they kill him okay we're in trouble <laughs> i have half hp uh i don't have any food on me i 
think we're good to go home. Oh, I should have written down the coordinates. Oh God, I traveled too far. Maybe my base is this direction. I'm also getting so incredibly low on rockets. And you're gonna fall off. I was like, I did see another one though. Yes. <laughs> Oh, okay. We finally found the portal. No. <gasps> oh, God. But there's a gas. There's piglins. We're going home. We're going home. Hey, look. There's my portal. Goodbye, everyone. Don't call. I will not answer. Yeah, at least I uh, left myself some chicken so I can heal right when I get home. Yum, yum, yum. Good Popeye's chicken. And then... Now we got some pork chops. We need to make a way, way bigger sugarcane farm. Man, I really wish I could use bone meal on that. Yes, I know chickens, you're going wild, but I need to continue planting all of these. Oh wait, I just remembered I have bamboo in my chest. Oops, I need to use up that first before I farm these. I was thinking of tearing down the jungle and then I can make like a sugarcane farm there. But maybe if I just clean up this place and then maybe just make some water channels and then I can make a sugarcane farm. Let's just tear this down. Am I the only one that gets very satisfied? So like, oh, there's ladders right here. And if you just break the one block, it breaks everything connected to it. And here we go, house is done. Hopefully it doesn't come as a shocker to any of you. Do not care for any of these blocks. Definitely need to get rid of this. Ooh. Ooh, sweet, all of our food's done. Let's try and be smart about this. Sugar cane, water, sugar cane, sugar cane, water. 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 Actually really annoying. That's like the perfect spot for me to not fix. Oh, well, okay. I guess the water's gonna be going over the edge. Oops. I think that's perfect. Second line done. Oh man, I'm really hoping this doesn't take that long for them to grow. Now this part is gonna be very expensive but I think it'll be worth it just because like it'll make it less annoying when I go around to uh, collect all of them. And then we just go through and we fill in every single part that the water is going to go into. I can just like, instead of having to jump, I can just walk through and it'll just make collecting the sugar cane a lot faster. Oh, I'm really hoping that this is enough. I really hope I don't need to make more. Oh, okay, wait, wait, we need to go make more. Every single part is done. Okay, one line is completely done. Just need to complete the rest. Oh, I need to actually put ground over here or else some of the sugar cane could just fall off the edge. Probably should get rid of this tree. Um, yeah, pr probably would be a good idea because uh, this is now stunting the growth of the sugar cane. I can't tell if this is faster, but it's kind of cool. Definitely not faster. <laughs> and done. This will probably take the remaining amount of the movie just to plant them everywhere. Wow, okay. Well, uh, hopefully they grow soon. So now I'm thinking if we do two blocks and then just for anybody who cares like on, on a massive amount, you know, for a uh, color combos and stuff. There you go. This should drive you insane. <laughs> yeah, this should be good enough. There we go. Bring this one out. Yep, that should be far enough. Very nice. We should be building the house pretty soon, so it might be best to, you know, actually get a lot of wood for it. So I got every single birch tree. Uh, the biggest thing is that the entire time that I'm doing that, yeah, you, you can hear them right now. Yeah, there, there's just some lovely zombies somewhere and I really want to get rid of them. Oh, hey, look, I found them. Oh, hi, buddy. Oh, not bad. I'll always take some coal. Oh, <gasps> Oh, whoa, there's like a meteor or, oh no, no, it's the core of the fork. I wonder how many source blocks are in this because I kind of want to take out all of the lava. Let's actually make a spot for the lava away from all of my wooden structures. Of course, I know what I could do because I saw some comments about this and it, it was a pretty good idea actually, is that I use lava for all of my uh, smelting stuff, which it's not a bad idea. Thank you for the tips. I do appreciate those. But since I have, you know, unlimited bamboo, Dude, there's really no point. Nice. And the best part is that I don't need to worry about lighting it up because lava does it for me. Probably 12 buckets of lava in there. And uh, this might be a little bit bigger than 12. There's a random pathway going straight down with a lot of lava. So far, I think I've collected 13 buckets of lava. It is kind of the perfect size. Now have redstone, redstone, you already guessed it, and some more of that. Oh, okay, so it's just gonna keep going down. <laughs> so let's crack this bad boy open. Oh, there's a chest. <laughs> it just keeps going down. All right, let's at least collect this, see what's inside. Watch it be a diamond axe. Like the one thing that I haven't found. Oh, wow. Oh, 
Ooh, and there's some iron here. Yes, please give me a lot, please. I will take the diamonds next. I want to keep exploring this. Nothing. Well, uh, here, I'll, I'll plug you back up. At least now I have a whole lot of lava, which I don't know what to do with. I'm hoping I have enough time to build a house, but I'm pretty sure I do. So, I mean, it doesn't have to be that crazy, even though I say that now, but I already know I'm going to go crazy. I think we're definitely uh, late enough into the game. Yeah, let's uh, collect all of this. Thank you. Uh, yeah, we'll just put you there. doesn't matter. Yeah, so you go there. One of you. I like the name of uh, Demon Slayer more. So there we go. So now we'll have Smite 3, Unbreaking 1, and Looting 1. And perfect. Oh, sweet. It does heal it a little bit. Okay, yeah, yeah. We're definitely doing that. And there we go. Okay, so now we have four. Oh, sweet. We can actually do every single diamond piece that we have. Okay. Well, there you go. There you go. This is what I'm more used to looking at. I actually want to go and find that other, like, baby zombie. Yeah, because I hear a lot of them through this. Oh, hi. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, no. Okay, good. No, 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 no. Don't run through there. Oh, man. I forgot that creepers don't destroy things. And oh, my. <gasps> Another eye of ender. More netherite scrap. Iron. Okay, yes. I think if we head this direction, we should hit lava. Nice. Okay, yeah. We're just gonna... This might be huge. Hi. See, luckily, I don't need your spawner whatsoever because I already have my own mob spawner. <laughs> so this is the only thing that I don't like about staying up late in here you know like past the night is that all of them spawn in oh look at our farm iron goes in there gold goes in there okay so now that we have 30 bone meal hopefully no enemies in this forest perfect 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 and then the reason why i wanted to do that is so now we can go over here okay let's see how much we got from this please be a lot of wheat please <laughs> That's actually really not that bad. Uh, that is a ton of seeds. Ooh, before we do that, I think this is more important. This should actually multiply fast as, you know, if it all gets to like two blocks high. Now we're gonna make the chickens go absolutely bonker crazy. And we just need to add in every single seed to this massive place. All chickens, please come over here. Be kind to Betsy. Ah, day 69. Stop laughing. And yeah, I kind of want to go check out the flying ship. I guarantee you, there has to be something else in there. But let's go see the friendly locals. What do you spawn? That's a vindicator. Oh, actually, this isn't a flying ship. This is a flying emerald farm. There's also a chest up there and I kind of want it. Please don't come over here yet. No, no, I need to, I need to rob you first, please. Huh. Oh, we can make another netherite. Oh my gosh. And hello there, Emerald Farm. Oh, I think we're going to be farming here for a little bit. Oh my God. I thought I just fell down there. Ooh -wee. Okay, they spawn Vindicators. Okay, this is going to be a very, very nice ship. Okay, nothing back here. Oh wow, they got solar panels. Ooh, environmentally friendly. Where are my Vindicators? I want my emeralds. Oh, you still can't get up? Man, that sucks. Oh, hi. You found the stairs. No, you're supposed to give me unlimited emeralds. And thank goodness you guys can't come up here. Okay, well, how many of them are there down there? Okay, I think we need to do the uh, the spawn trick where you fly away, unload those chunks, and then they despawn. I, I think it's time to do that. Ow. I'm not seeing any kind of movement inside, so I think they actually despawned. I do want to make that uh, netherite sword upgrade. So we do this, go to this. Oh yeah, sharpness one sweeping edge. Where's, oh wait, can sharpness not go on here because of smite? Sharpness or smite? I think this is the better one because then at least we have sharpness on this. I mean, it's one of everything, but yeah, no, I think that's better. I'm starting to think that we're really not gonna have like any time to build. Also, we'll just leave everything in there. I just want some arrows. Okay, so we have 38 arrows, that should be fine. Oh man. I just really hope that there's no evokers over there. Dang it, I thought that was an emerald block. Oh, I got so excited for a second. Which one are you? There's a spawner in there. Dang it. Run, 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 run. Come on. I did get another one though, so we are fine. We didn't even make a loss. They're so tanky. I hear it, I hear it. I also really hate the fact that they can spawn in with enchanted swords. Oh god, that's a flaming baby. Oh my god, the flaming baby lit me on fire. Okay, buddy. Oh my god, that was almost all of my health. So get this, right? You know, I was just uh, sleeping at my bed as one does during the night. There's emeralds down there. Too bad I got a really good emerald farm right over here. <laughs> yeah, I really, really wouldn't mind finding some paper and a chest. Hey, buddy. You see, everyone's worried about the wardens, but dang, I don't remember these being so deadly. I mean, I do have maxed out netherite armor in my hardcore world. So, I mean, yeah, it makes sense. It makes sense. Hi. Oh my God. That actually made me jump a little. I think I jumped down here. I think I, I think I chanced it. Whoa. Oh yes. Nope. Can't get me. Kind of useless. I will take the arrows though. Wow. Look at that. We can get some leather armor, but we do have a God apple, which I'm going to keep right there. 
because I have a feeling I might need to use it. Wait, we've gotten eight emeralds since being here? Oh man, this is good. Watch this, yo, if you come over here, you can actually get up here and die just like that. Wow, you guys are incredibly fast and kind of scary. Yeah, it's right, 13. Oh, we can get mending. Like, I'm so greedy. I, I really want more. Like, I want a lot of emeralds. They can't get under here. Iron block. So I want to go get my other emeralds and then i think we're gonna go and check out the shop oh please don't ruin my crops i would plant these but i really really do need some more rockets we have five god apples <laughs> yeah i think we're definitely good at the dragon i have 35 but don't you worry villagers i'm coming oh we have so much capitalism to do okay john yes yes first off i think mending is smart i think a little bit more iron netherite scrap and then we can turn my pants into netherite you might want another one of those just to be safe awesome thank you for the trades gentlemen it was amazing and doing business with you before we go back home i actually want to see if i can find this tunnel ha ah, i knew it wow imagine if i came here at the beginning of the game <laughs> okay let's quickly add mending to this bad boy perfect okay so i have protection three frost walker two fire protection one i mean like i'll just i'll put all these on my stuff right now because like there's literally no point in just holding them protection three on you frost walker on you we have shiny netherite armor yes we can make five you go there 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 there's so many creepers oh sweet it's actually fully healed now it doesn't even really matter about my rockets other than going to the end there's always a way for me to get over here at least yeah you can 100 percent glide from there to here all righty get in the safe spot oh my i didn't even need to buy netherite oh i don't want you coming over to me though I forgot for a second that i'm 100% safe from him. Loser. Nice. We've completely looted this place. You see, since it was nighttime, I have to watch out for my ops. I think I want to buy more diamonds just to make a chest plate. You are. We now have five eyes of ender. I would kill you, buddy, but I don't need you. Thank you. Please don't be thunder. So, well, this was the shortest day of the century. Basically, we just lost a day for nothing. Um, but yeah, I just, I don't like lightning. I don't want it burning stuff. However, okay, so regardless of all that, okay, we need to get away from the green wiener. And yeah, let's go over to the end portal. So let's just put these in now because, you know, might as well. And yeah, we just need five more. I, I was hoping that, you know, that I wanted, but I guess we do need to go back into the nether. Maybe tomorrow. Get some blaze powder. Okay, we should be able to sail all the way down there. Oh, just be nice once uh, all of the sugar cane is completely planted because then uh, I don't need to worry about spawn proof and anything. So now let's actually get ready for some more capitalism. I think we should make the chest plate just in case for the dragon fight. Yoo-hoo, John. Uh, books. Okay, so we have 32 to play with. Sheesh, that was really expensive. And we can get one mending. That kind of sucks. I was expecting a little bit more. Okay, never mind. Maybe we should put mending on our armor. There we go. Because, you know, it's a little damaged. Don't really want to lose it. And we build a chest plate. Oh, vindicators. Yoo-hoo. Let's very quickly. Looting three. Ooh, I like you. Because we're already at five emeralds with just looting one. So imagine looting three on this. Okay, so let's get rid of these guys. Oh no, they're waiting at my escape. I sneak past and I jump. Just look at them all burn. They thought they were going to get me. I'm way too slimy for them to touch me. <laughs> this beautiful sword now has looting three. Wow, that's going to take all of my... Oh my god, that scared me. Okay, so that's gonna take all of my levels. However, this thing is totally worth it. Okay, now that we have looting three, let's actually spend the day over there. Because so far, they're just dropping two. Oh, what? Yeah, I was just trying to get some blocks, cover up the hole, and then, okay, sweet. Hopefully, got some good loot in here. So far, it's actually kind of the same right. I think these guys are just dropping one. We're gonna run up there, cover that hole, then that spawner should be working. The second I cover that, boom, it's already working. So I guess looting three doesn't make them drop more. It just makes it a higher chance for them to drop stuff. The 50 emeralds, I can turn that into another right and then we'll put mending on it so i have 30 here i have 20 back at base we're at 50 and just like that now we're at 80 yeah no we we, yeah, we have a lot okay so we could put mending on everything <laughs> another right on that okay that was really loud oh uh, it's the boots that's what it is i kind of regret putting frost walker on those i i have absolutely no idea how to make a grindstone two of those one there oh my god yes okay it's regular stone put you on that okay perfect okay we go to you and then we buy as many as we can wow okay never mind oh we actually got mending for every single thing and then i have 11 left over if anything maybe we just get golden apples we might need to go to the grinder for some xp actually we'll do that first before heading back to the house okay before farming for more xp might as well 
just attach as many as we can to this. Oh, we need 33 for the Demon Slayer. Okay. Dude, that scares me every single time and I don't know why. Oh, we very barely had enough. However, this one isn't almost broken, so it actually should last us a while. Okay, next we do our shovel. Then we do our axe. Then we do the wonderful bow and our chest plate, which hopefully we use. I'll kind of laugh if we don't. Every single thing has mending on it. Oh, we're not going to get any XP until everything's fully healed. Okay, not too bad. I'm already level seven. I kind of want to heal up all my stuff. <laughs> I know we need the levels, but uh, I don't I don't like seeing stuff with like a health bar on it down there. <laughs> no! Oh. So you know how I have a lot of chickens like did you know that uh killing chickens can uh give you xp i am noticing that the sugar cane is actually growing a ton creepers are getting a little bit too brave god dang it i didn't want to fly into it very nice second row is done yeah i really don't think i'm going to be able to finish off this uh farm before the movie's over okay we're not gonna go around and harvest the entire place i'm just doing this just to get some seeds and i'm sure there will probably be some comments about the uh the creeper's not destroying anything. I'm so I don't know how to turn that back on. Now, the thing is, do I want to heal up my stuff or do I just want to go for levels so I can put uh, mending on my sword? First, we breed them. If I use my sword, it's going to kill the babies. And I mean, I don't need it. But another really good thing about this is that uh, I'm going to get a lot of cooked chicken from this. Uh, Good luck, baby chickens. Uh, If you're wondering where your parents went, they just went to Target. We go over here. We go to this lovely thing wow that is a lot of chicken to cook i wonder if more people would get into farming on minecraft and be like you know actually into that stuff if they implemented you gaining xp whenever you broke a fully grown crop um okay i want to see how good vindicators are for xp i can already tell that this is actually not good uh my mob arm is actually faster yeah the only reason why i'm staying is actually strictly just for the emeralds <laughs> okay, not bad we're at 39 oh i forgot oh i still have the golden apples on me oh, i swear every single day these bees fly like one more block away from the aisle the fork is not that bad come on i was gonna build you a nice place and speaking of nice place uh i don't know if i could do like a really nice mega build house kind of a deal so yeah don't be angry uh it's just there was a lot to do um i just want to get a little bit of experience from them actually no okay the shovel's pretty good i want to work on my pickaxe just a little bit wow there are so many of you yes however okay we need to be wise with our time you know we can't spend too much time you know trying to heal up everything get xp blah 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 it's really not that important you know all of this stuff will last me until the end of the movie. And I am curious about one thing. Do you guys ever want me to do 200 days on something? Like, I feel like, you know, just doing 100 days, I've already done everything for these movies. And I feel like 200 days would be boring. But I am curious how many of you would actually like 200 day movies. Oh, I'm coming in for a whole lot of golden apples and XP. You're, you're, you're going to sting out on me? You're not going to give me any XP? Okay, well, I mean, okay, we could plant some. I at least... Okay, I want, I want to keep eight. How about that? Even though it is starting to get nighttime, but you know, we don't have to worry about nighttime in the nether. And now the hard part, uh, finding a fortress. Oh, fortress. I wouldn't be mad at all if you'd want to jump out at me and be like, ooh, boo. Here's some blazes. Here's the blaze rods you need. I wonder if there's any other way to get blaze rods if I can't find the blazes. Yeah, let's fly under. What's the worst that could happen? Am I the only one noticing that there's no regular biome? Really don't think there's a fortress in here. I'm also starting to get low on rockets. <laughs> oh, note to anyone who plays on this map. Do not break that blaze spawner <laughs> back at the castle. Uh, that is a very very big mistake maybe i can get eyes of ender from the fork yeah before i get too low on rockets i think it's just time to return home so there's only one thing that i want to check out before we go back to the fork and just start digging around everywhere trying to find it I wonder if any of them can naturally spawn in here or maybe I'm, you know, super lucky and there's at least one that I uh, didn't break. You really don't need to come over here. It's to totally fine. I wonder if there's hidden treasure. Oh, hey, look, there's hidden treasure. I wonder if there's anywhere where there's hidden blaze powders or rods. That'd be really good. Oh my God. He just spawned right on top of me. Hi. Yeah, sadly, I don't don't think we're gonna find any luck here let's go try back at home maybe we can be lucky lovely yep i desperately need you okay so we're back we're back to 46 oh i mean so far we've been finding a lot of eyes of ender over there i wonder if there's any hidden treasure 
Oh, hey, look, there's a chest. Ah, <laughs> oh, it was so close to being good. That's skeleton? Nothing out here. Because that's one thing that I'm noticing about this map creator is that uh, they like their hidden chest. And then I'm curious if there is anything at the bottom of this. I'm not removing all of that lava, but uh, I have a strong feeling there's a chest hidden down there somehow. Hey, look, there's another chest. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> another Idex. Yeah, that would have been good uh, a lot earlier. Here, let's, let's go have some target practice. Why not? I don't want to take too much of this XP. I'm trying to use it wisely. There we go. Go. Don't be thunder, please. I can't afford to lose a day. I don't think it's dark enough though. I think this is regular rain. Let's go check this out. I want to dig around here some more. I'm very curious to see if there's any hidden chests. Okay, first let's check underneath the rocket ship. No, but I found some obsidian. That's cool. We might have found something. I found some lapis. Wait, is this the same exact cave? That's right. Wait, wait, wait. I never fully explored this place. Trying to keep my hopes up. Okay, there's another cave somewhere because I keep hearing spiders. Oh, hi. <laughs> I was gonna say, which sounds like if I go this way, I should find it. Hey, look, I found it. It's another one of those weird uh, magma cube hearts, which leads into a tunnel. And there's another tunnel that way. First, let's get all this stuff. Okay, you. Whoa. Oh yeah, that's a stone sword. Never mind, not as cool. I think we're I think we're doing the right thing though, because at least we're finding chests. It's just it's not chests that we want. This way. Wow. Oh, well, at least I get some special arrows. This is kind of cool. Yeah, let's break that spawner. Want to come down here? <gasps> yes. Yes, we got one. Okay, we need four more. I want the. I want that. So loot we want to keep is over here. I want that iron vendor right there just so I can keep a nice eye on it. Okay, perfect. There we go. Found it. All right, look at chest. Uh, let's go drop this all off and go to sleep. So looking at the size of that, I have a strong feeling there's like one or two more caves. Yeah, and I, I didn't even really go down that far. Can I land inside? Please. Okay, I at least put down the water. I just don't want to waste rockets. Um, yeah, there has to be something else. I just realized I didn't put away anything. Oops, please, Iavender, please. I found the creepers. Yeah, he's gonna blow them all up. Yeah, buddy. Okay, let's remove that. Collect you. I mean, I guess at the very least, I am getting some resources, which, you know, it, it is cool. It's just, you know, we're, uh, we're oh my God, don't fall down there. Oh man, that could have been really bad. Yeah, they're like roughly, oh my, <gasps> oh, hi, gorgeous. Yeah, oh, Oh my gosh, I can combine mending with feather falling. Dang it, I need more XP. Yeah, that was just a random chest in here. I only found that because I heard skeletons. Okay, so the floating island is actually really worth it to just go around and dig. Oh, hi. Please, dang it. Oh dear God, the amount of time that it's gonna take me to mine through that. I'm, I'm pretty positive there's nothing inside of this obsidian. The last one that I dug through, it was just obsidian. I think we found everything. I'm, I'm pretty comfortable with leaving this island now. Hello, Emerald. Ah, the sun is shining. The mobs are burning, except for him, because he sucks. So first off, I want to see how much would this cost? Okay, not bad, four levels. So I was honestly expecting that to be a lot worse. So uh, I'm, I'm very grateful for that. <laughs> yeah, let's combine the pick with fortune. Please don't be a lot. Okay, three. The only other like island that I could really check for caves would just be the ghost town. Yep, I knew it. <laughs> <gasps> yes! Oh, yes. Oh, thank God we checked it. And there's another fortune. Oh, I can make a fortune two pick. Okay, we need three more. And I promise you, I'm just making educated guesses. I didn't plant this. <laughs> the map creator is kind of obvious to me. Okay, I think it's safe to say there's nothing. Uh, Let's actually check below the legs. Okay, let's dig the ground underneath them as well. Just double check. Maybe we'll be lucky and we don't need, you know, any blazes at all. Oh, I'm just, I'm so hopeful that everything. Hi. Yeah. I'm, I'm just, I'm really hoping that everything we need is uh, on these islands. And then let's just check a little bit over here. The fact that I'm not hearing any enemies as well. So I really don't think this island has enemies. I mean, enemies, caves. Yes, there's really nothing under here. I mean, at least we got one more eye of Ender tonight. So it wasn't too bad. I kind of doubt there's anything on the plane, but I wonder if there's anything in the engines. Then let's combine our lovely pick. Now we have fortune two. Wow, we actually might have to focus on healing that pick pretty soon what is the health 500 on it nah it can survive let's check the back of the plane first because now thinking about it i don't really believe that it's empty wow the uh, the plane actually didn't have anything okay okay did you know it is against the law to eat chicken with a fork in gainesville georgia okay so let's check out the engines 
Oh, there's an underbelly. Maybe a little bit more forward and there's something. So, okay, so we're right below the villager's room. I'm actually shocked there's no chest hidden in here. And then let's just check the engine over here. Yeah, there's nothing. And then let's just check out the tains again up here. Hi, right, look, I found lava. Here we go. This is how you get rid of lava very easily. Nice. All right, five, not bad. Let's check right here, see if there's anything. Oh, there's coal. Oh, wow. Well. Uh, let's go to sleep and then we're gonna see if we can find some more caves like actually on the, uh, the fork. You, uh, you a little lost? Oh, oh, you need this? Oh, okay, yeah, dude, just come, come over here. I'll give you some. Um, I mean, you were so close. Like, if you came, like, right there, I was, I was gonna save you. Obviously, we're not gonna be healing this up much. I just probably want to get it to, like, 800 or something. Come on. I know there has to be, like, a lot up there. Come on. I just, all of you just jump down here. I want, like, 200 mobs right here. Okay, it's almost at 900. We're completely good. Uh, don't want the iron sword. And let's go. I did that, you know, it's, you know, I kind of wasted some time doing that. But I think it was worth it strictly just because of the fact that I now have a good pick for the rest of the movie. So, I think if we go down here... Please make it. Oh my god, that was really close. So I'm not hearing anything at all. Let's just start digging this direction. We're gonna check below the jungle. Uh, it's something I don't want to do. It's just I really want to kill the dragon. So I wonder. I wonder if it would even be okay if I were to, you know, just spawn in however many uh eyes of Ender that I need. Like I really don't want to. It's just I kind of wasn't expecting, you know, that one blaze spawner to be the only spawner to ever get uh, okay, blazes. I am starting to hear some enemies, so that might be a good sign. We might not have to cheat. Hi, right, buds. Don't shoot me. Shoot him. Oh, okay, thank you. Thank you bat for taking the shot. That's one okay, thank um that's one thing I don't understand about Mojang is how they won't add in some uh mobs that like a lot of people really really want because they're useless to the game. What's the point of a bat? I'll always take diamonds, love those. Wow, that is a lot of sugar cane. Dang, we almost got two stacks from that one uh harvest. And then I think tomorrow, depending on how much it actually grows, we actually might be uh done. When I was digging forward, I'm really hoping I wasn't hearing the enemies above. Oh no, I'm not hearing anything now. Oh cool. Is that the- oh yeah, nope, we're- we're at the edge. Oh, hey, look, I found a dungeon. Cool, this isn't a dungeon. We found a jungle temple. Okay, obviously it's all hidden. There's no way this entire jungle temple- okay, there we go. Dang it. Please don't be the only chest. Oh, yes. Oh. It's because I'm a mastermind. I knew it had to be right there. Oh. Okay. Sadly, we might be done. So I heard some water. Is it down? Hi. Wow. First guess. Let's actually check over here. Let's block you off as much as I would love to be pushed around by water. Why does that sound like a campfire? I, I swear I'm not going crazy. There's 100% there's something hidden here. Oh, hi. Uh, God apple. Eh, more arrows. So are there other? Hi. Eh. Was that everything? Is there something over here? Hi. <laughs> Okay, so we found rooms all along there. Maybe there's something down here. Oh, <gasps> oh, bone blocks. I'm gonna make an educated guess and say that yes, we did find everything in this little section. Still at two, and I am really, I'm, I'm starting to lose hope. <laughs> I really don't think we're gonna be able to get to the end. Legit, like you know, unless I just you know open up to land. Hey, did you know that in the Roman Empire, certain classes, their forks were actually made out of bronze bronze and iron. Okay, so another section that I'm kind of suspicious about is this lava one. Oh, right, sweet. <laughs> yeah, usually there's something always right next to lava. So uh, really good to dig it out. Go here. Okay, that was a very quick one. Let's check here. Oh, hi. I hate you. <gasps> oh, channeling. Kind of useless. And I still very strongly think that there's something in the tines. And then I feel like this has to be hiding something. Come on, good loot. Just jump out at me. Be like, here you go, skies. I got three eyes of ender right here. Clean that up. Hi, buddy. <gasps> I love you. Oh, oh my god, we just need two more. I just want to find them. My friends didn't tell me the exact location, but apparently base of sand area. I'm starting to think my friends lied to me. So far, there is nothing in the sandy area. My friends weren't lying. But literally, like, nothing that I really care about. Okay, yeah, uh, let's just go to sleep. Apparently, at the top, that's usually where there's something from what I've heard. I know that it's technically cheating, but I just, I don't want to spawn in Eyes of Vendor, but this is probably like the best route to take. I don't know what's in these chests as well. When in doubt, dirt it out, please. I hate you. So there's something else over here in the desert near the top again. Oh, and they still are. Oh, okay. I mean, there's a totem of undying in there. That's kind of cool. Okay, so I'm just going to take a very wild guess 
Um, since these are kind of lined up, I'm going to assume it's right around there. We need to find it soon. This pick is almost broken. Is there just nothing on this time? Yeah, uh, very sadly, I really don't want to do this, but we have to go heal up the pick some more or else it's really going to go bad. Oh, I hate creepers. I hate creepers. I hate creepers. Did I build a creeper farm or did I build a mob farm? I really don't need all of this. I think we need to open up all of these. Almost 700. I'm trying to rush. Okay, it's at 800. Honestly, that's good enough. Okay, let's go. There's a chest here somewhere. I know it. If we don't find it by digging uh, little holes like this into the ground, then we're just going to start mining through the entire pine. I didn't really dig it that well, so maybe it's down here. Uh, nothing in this hole. <gasps> oh my god, we found it. Oh, and there's nothing in it. So let's go check out the snow biome. I'm just, we're going to make it fast. I'm just going to check that top candy cane. But since I've already found so much there, I really don't think there's anything left. Well, at least snow goes fast. So we got that going for us. Oh, well, I, I, I think it's safe to say nothing's up here. The only place, like maybe there's something over there that I missed. And then maybe, maybe I didn't check through all those islands well enough. Double check our work. Oh, I didn't even check this. So there might actually be something still on this island like a golden block that I really, uh, really needed. I knew it. Please, I have ender. Uh, in fact, let's just use it right now. I would use it to heal up that. Actually, we're not even close to level 33. Never mind. We are going to use it to heal up this. Oh, <gasps> hi. Uh, uh, it, it looks like we might actually have to cheat here just before we go to sleep. Let's go into here, put in these eyes of ender. Yeah, we oh, we need two more. I guess we double check Poland area. Wow. Like, I swear, the longer sugarcane is down, the faster it grows. I can't be the only one that thinks that, right? Did I go overboard with creating a sugarcane farm this massive? Maybe. Four and a half stacks. Uh, yeah, I think we'll have enough to finish off the farm. <laughs> like, we're finally... At least we never need to worry about uh, being careful with how many rockets we use. Before the day is over, let's go back over here. This place is so massive, there has to be something near the surface. Oh, hi. Please, I have entered. <laughs> oh. That's good and bad at the same time. Oh, uh, that only had one. God, maybe if we're lucky, there's something else other than lapis blocks. Well, I didn't find anything. I wonder if there's anything at the B. I mean, it's kind of fun. I won't lie. Like, I'm actually kind of enjoying this. I might have to go get this on my hardcore world, which if you haven't seen that series, 100% recommend it. Dang, that's a lot of XP. I can't believe I never checked out the nether island. Oh! <gasps> Oh my god, and it's a double. Please, just one. Just one eye of ender. I'm gonna cry. I saw the ender pearl, and I, I actually got, like, kind of excited for a second, and then that... I can't believe the map comes with uh, enough eyes of ender around the entire map for, like, 11. Yeah, I think it's just all portal. The last section with any chest at all would be the ship. Uh, yeah, we're gonna check out the ship tomorrow. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna be smart. And we're going to break every single spawner. I, I don't need any more emeralds. So I don't need people spawning in trying to, you know, eat my, my, my booty. Quickly, hi. Run around, light up the place. Oh, no. There's an entire... Wait, wait, wait. There's an easy way through this. Okay, I don't see any chests. Let's check back here in the engine. Oh, this would actually be a really good spot to hide a chest. There actually could be a chest in this. We just start mining our way down. Okay, so there's nothing there. Mine out the stairs. Maybe there's something hidden. Maybe underneath these? Okay, yeah, this is pretty futile. Yep, doesn't look like there's any chest at all. Like the first time ever, I actually need to spawn in an item just so I can uh, beat it. Okay, so I spawn in myself another Eye of Ender uh, just so you, know, you guys don't think you know, I'm cheating or anything. Boom, chat log, there's nothing there. If I look at the pause menu, open the land. So, alrighty, a lovely portal who has caused me a lot of pain and suffering. If it comes out that I missed one chest and it had the Eye of Ender, I'm going to be a little sad. Okay, so now that we can actually go and fight the Ender Dragon, first up, let's go and get you know refueled. Okay, since we have like a day or two, let's actually go and heal up. Oh, it's a little baby. Aw. Did me spawning in the Eye of Ender just break my game or something? Hello? So am I going to have to fight the dragon with my soul? I'm almost tempted to farm here over the night. Okay, so it's day 99 and uh, we actually need to go fight the dragon now. <laughs> uh, usually it takes me more than a day with, you know, very bad bows. So at least this bow will be stronger. 
Yeah, power three. Sweet. Okay, we have to bring the snowballs. We're using that. We're completely good on food. We don't need any building blocks. We're just gonna be flying. I didn't even realize I had feather falling one. Okay, let's add that to the boots. I think we have everything. This is just, I feel so naked. Just because uh, I don't have time to actually build a bee area. Everyone say hello to Bumble. I honestly think I want to do that. I, I, I kind of want to use all of the, uh, the tridents. I think it'd be really funny. Oh, dragon, your demise is coming. I can't can't get over the look of the end it's so beautiful and it's gonna be almost as beautiful as me killing the dragon okay not maybe, maybe not that close to it oh okay Ooh, we're destroying all crystals in record time it's almost like having an elytra here helps out immensely like i'm trying not to blow myself up and it's actually really hard okay we got 16 left but we're almost completely done i should be able to shoot like right through it oh i need to get away from her oh man i thought she was chasing me i think every single one is down there we go we're gonna use the first trident where'd she go i have a bone to pick with you i don't care if i lose this i just really want to hit you yes that does no damage. Okay, we just need to start shooting her. This is amazing. No, no, no. Please stay right here. This is actually amazing. Yeah. Yo, do you want to play around with my tridents again? Yoosh. There you go. Another hit. I'm just beaming you nonstop. If this was Call of Duty, you'd be crying that I have an aimbot right now. This is too easy. Okay, as I just missed like the next two shots. You know what? Just because I have eight of these and you know, I have I don't think I've ever actually used a god apple before. Boom, baby. Boom, baby. Ba-boom. Oh, too easy. There we go. Now we are. Oh, Oh my gosh, the damage on that. You forgot, I can fly after you. I don't have to stay on the ground. I'm like one of you. There you go. See, this is more exciting if you just fly around and fight it. I'm too clean with the shots. See, I told all of you back in that one block Loki block video, I told you it was the bow, not me. There we go. Okay, so kind of luckily we were able to kill it or her. There we go. We can actually heal up all of our stuff completely except for our sword because, oh well. It's a very important addition to our house. Uh, just me here, just to celebrate. Nom, 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 nom. So many god apples oh devour look at this congo line no let's sleep right next to the dragon egg and there we have it i survived 100 days on a fork and minecraft hardcore now, honestly this was really fun i know i didn't build like a massive build i'll, I'll try to uh, the next 100 days movie but uh, i hope you guys still enjoyed it i think it was very adventurous we were able to do a lot so i hope you guys enjoyed the 100 days on a fork and yeah i'll see you guys next time thanks for watching